Rick, man, how you doing? What a beautiful locale for, for, for having a sandwich. This is an amazing patio, yeah. You need to come visit. Why haven't you come? It's not Carnival yet. I'll come when it's Carnival time. Okay. <laughs> so your new show, Prebolo, uh, both for people who don't speak Spanish very well uh, and for newcomers to the show, what does it literally mean and what does it mean to you? So Prebolo is what people say when they want you to try something that they just cooked or something that they've grown or something that they love. And that's what I'm gonna be doing for you. I'm gonna be taking you to all the places that I love most so that you can try all the things that I love here in Mexico. I'm definitely coming. Uh, I'm, I think I speak for everybody who's tuning in for the first time. We're really excited to try new things with you and welcome to the BCU, buddy. All right, so let's take a look at the first episode of Rick Martinez's new show, Prebolo. Welcome to Mexico, Prevalo. So a couple of weeks ago, we went on a hike to Isla Venados, and this guy randomly caught three beautiful langosta and said, do you want to try these? And I was like, well, obviously. And so he threw them in some garlic flavored oil, fried them up, served them with hot tortillas and this pico de gallo that his wife just made. It was one of the most amazing breakfasts I've ever had in my entire life. So that's what we're gonna be doing today, making tacos de langosta. Oh, I'm just gonna take a bite. <laughs> I am not a morning person. I hate morning, but I decided to get up early because I really, really want to get a langosta. So I found Don Ricardo. He told me that we could probably get a couple and so that's why we're out here today. So we can get some langostas, we can go back and make these incredible tacos. <laughs> Two langostas are all I need for the filling. For the salsa, my friend Claudia makes an incredible chili de arbol and habanero salsa that would be perfect in these tacos. I'm heading to her stand now to eat and to ask how she makes it. Hola, Claudia. Hola, bienvenidos. Estamos en Y la Jenny Rivera. I'm already crying. I might have already had three. <laughs> mm. She told me she boils her chilies in a little water until they're soft enough to blend, then tosses it with a little onion and avocado. Sounds super easy. So now I'm heading to my favorite mercado, Pino Suarez, to buy everything I need to get started. Rick, yeah. you should try this one. These? Yeah, these are Mazatlecon. Really? Yeah. Wait, what do they have in them? What, why are they? It's coconut. Like it's like a... Really? Yeah. They're like coconut marshmallows? Yeah. Oh my god. All right, yeah. We're definitely yeah. taking these. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna try. <laughs> All right. Oh. <laughs> it's gonna be really messy. <laughs> oh, I love this part. Yeah. 
Mm. Uh, it's about to drip back. <laughs> mm. Mm. Oh my god. That is so good. <laughs> Holy sh**. Where have these been all my life? Oh my god. <laughs> The thing that I love about Glavia salsa is that it makes me cry every time I eat it, and I kind of want to cry. <coughs> Whoa. I do want to taste it, actually. It's really good, but it's not as hot as I thought it was going to be. That color is so beautiful. Oh my God. Pigeon flew into my house and I didn't know what to do. And I was just gonna leave and see if he like let himself out. <laughs> so what you're telling me is you really need a drink. Yes, okay. that's what I'm telling you. Okay. Well great. Well, <laughs> cheers. Cheers. Staying in muzzle on forever. Yes. <laughs> okay. You ready? Right. So excited. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. That was actually better than I expected. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. I'm never gonna steam or boil a lobster again. Yeah. Why why would you do that? I don't know. But I'm not dead. <laughs> you are crying, that's good. I made somebody cry today. I'm sweating. <laughs> This episode was all about Mazatlan. One of my favorite tacos that I've eaten here, but there are so many other dishes I want you to try. There's so many other places that I want to take you to. And that's what the show is going to be all about. Me taking you to my favorite places in Mexico and eating the best food in the country. Come with me. Bravo. Okay. <laughs>